Hi guys, and welcome to another shorter episode. Here on Doubtful Farm, playing more realistic. I'm still feeling crap, I have got a good few days left before I get into the doctors. Plus side though, I'm feeling a little better. Tea tree oil is working in a diluted state. So, some good news. We'll see what the doc says. <laughs> Probably won't be happy that I'm trying to self-medicate. Yeah. Anyway, focus. You're going to see some clips for this episode. I have been working these fields for a full day. Real time. <laughs> we have far too much land. And I still haven't finished. I haven't touched field one yet. I, I've got the fertiliser done, but I've not been in with a plough. I've not been in with a cultivator. It's just no. Field two. Uh, it's split into three sections now. East, centre and west. The west part has been ploughed, not cultivated. The centre part has been cultivated, thankfully. The east part has only been finished ploughing now. The T-dub's been in there. Uh, field 3, that's got an east and a west side. The fence has been in there, because I put a plough on the back of that as well. <laughs> Trying to sort of speed up the process. Uh, we ended up with the JD on the little 4 metre power hammer and I broke. I broke. If you remember from previous selling and finicking around, oh god I'm getting worse. I had three mil. I don't anymore. I put three mil into the farm account and I blew it. I paid off the loan and I got that. That is a 410 brake horsepower class 950 Axion. That is eight meters of wonderfulness. It is accompanied by, I think it's a 10 meter chisel or oh, time cultivator, deep, deep cultivator, deep penetration. This is a disc, basically. And then I've also got the big bud subsiler. That's all this is going to do is literally turn this earth and sharpish. I am not spending a day working these fields. It's too much, too long. And if I don't get it done, we're going to be doing the same crap again that we've been doing for God knows how long. I just seem to be always working the fields. I never get out of the good stuff because I end up changing map for God knows whatever reason. It's, yeah, it's time. <laughs> this is 410 break. <laughs> I've even MR'd this myself. Uh, what was it now? There is an MR of the 800, which doesn't go big enough. I think that stops around the 300 break mark. It's not enough. It doesn't give me the power I need. <laughs> this does. This is awesome. It's a beast. It's by Smetty. And because it's by Smetty, you do get some nice little features. He is using the same IC that was on the fence, though. So I've ripped it off so I could get on the bits that I like. There's nothing wrong with it. It's perfectly good enough. I've changed all the bits inside, made the buttons big so I can hit them. But the good thing about Smitty is, yes, all the lights light up inside. I don't have to do any of that myself. I put the sounds on. I never even tested this actually to find out if the sounds worked with it. As it's Smitty, it probably would have done. But anyway, it is a beast. Beautiful machine. Beautiful. I'm going to have a lot of fun with this. Uh, another reason for changing it was. I'm using, well this is an 8 meter, I'm using 4 meter kit so that I need two tractors to do the work of this one. And then it's the hired worker cost as well. I'm paying for two tractors when I only need to be paying for one. It's costing me a lot of money to work with the smaller gear. Uh, I'm happy with the cedars, I've got 6 meter cedars, I've got the Vedastar Rapide and the Tempo. But for like ploughing and such like, it sucks. It's costing me a fortune because... These are big fields. I mean, I've split this into three, and it's still huge. <laughs> Same with that. I was, I've not even been over to field one yet. It's, it's new for me, this. But it's probably time I played with some bigger stuff. Right, the T-dub's hanging in there at the minute. She's worked well on that plough. The Fed is just a master of that thing. I could probably pull a bigger plough, actually. That's that six bottom. The problem with that is, ploughs don't normally get along with things like uh, AI vehicle extension cosplay and that they complicate the process. So I'm trying to keep it to a fixed plough. 
I think the next one up is the one we had on Thornton. Yes, it is the Titan. Because I had a lot of fun with that on the back of that JD. Now I have MR to attract I may have got MR in another one and get that brought over. We'll see what the rental agreement is that Pete's out. Oh. So what we got over there, we've got the Valter S. Oh, that's T. SRT. I think it's the S now. But it's the Bailey one. So we can always get a new engine in that. There is the Fast Track and there is the JD. 85.30, did we go for that? I can't even remember. Yes, my babies. I want my babies back. But we shall see, we shall see. We have a TW, we've got the cool fence, and I'm really enjoying playing with that fence. And uh, what the hell's we got? Oh, that's a little JD, isn't it? Yes, that was being really weird on that power horror. Uh, did some fettling with the rock limits on the attached joints of the power harrow and it finally managed to sort of sit right. When you put the power harrow down, it was lifting the back of the tractor, so she was drifting while going in a straight line. That was fun. <sighs> anyway, I'm going to call it there, guys. As you can hear, my nose is bugging up from talking already. I'm getting worse. I do have some clips of the adventures of this long-ass day of trying to get this map back to where Thornton was. We're just about ready. This field is ready to plant. It's going with grass. No, which one is it? Control S, Alt S, Alt S. Now the problem is it's four degrees. So the only thing I can actually plant is grass until tomorrow. So I'm not actually behind because I can't plant anything else, which kind of works. Uh, if we go over to there, you can see that it's field one. Field one's dumbass. Look at the right one. Thank you. Field one. He's going to get wheat and soybean. Field 3 is going to get sugar beet and sunflower. That's over the water over there. Can't show you now because I've got the mouse up. Can we get rid of the mouse? Aha, we can. Right, field 3 is over there. That's field 3. This is field 2. So we have field 2 east, which is going to be grass. Field 2, as I said, I just called it field 2, which is going to be grass. And then wheat's going over there. So this one, that one can be seeded. This one can be seeded right now. It's ready. I got some dry fur down pellets out of the spinner. It's just been ploughed. It's been cultivated by the class. I got. It's, it took me a long time to get that little power harrow somewhere to about here. That finished it off in seconds. I mean, you can see how many hours it's got on it. It drove from the shop to here. Point two. Smashed it. Love the thing. Already. <laughs> I'm making use of the colours on the waist as well now. Why the hell not, eh? Uh, so you've got black. It kind of goes with the undercarriage. You've got blue. I think the other JD has black or grey as well, but I'm going to start getting colours for him. Why the hell not, eh? But yeah, I'm happy again. Buying this was a good call. Women go shopping and buy shoes. Men go shopping. We buy 400 brake tractors. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> anyway guys I'll put the clips on after this chatter a bit I uh, hope you enjoy and I will catch you next week hopefully I'll be feeling a bit better by then hopefully we'll see <laughs> later <laughs>